50 children are on the waiting list for a mentor with Big Brothers Big Sisters of East Tennessee, but there just aren't enough volunteers. This morning, we introduce you to Ryan and Kiwan in this week's Live a Little. We talk, we might go eat. For almost a year, Ryan and his little brother Kiwan have been exploring new ways to have some fun. Oh, no. We play sports. We'll come out here to Lakeshore. Let's do the big one. They both love football, but monkeying around on the playground is one of their favorites. His mom described him as a gentle giant, uh, and he's every bit of that. I mean, he's just such a sweet kid. The pair were matched last summer through Big Brothers Big Sisters of East Tennessee. The fourth grader and new dad have already learned a lot from each other. He's very intentional uh, and compassionate. He's got a great heart and I, I see that. Uh, how he interacts with other people, uh, my wife, my daughter. He helps me out when I'm mad, angry, frustrated. He helps me out when I'm happy. I just, I just like my big brother. <laughs> Ryan has become a role model to Kiwan, a mentor he can look up to. There's a lack of that at times uh, in Knoxville, but also just around the world. And so I just think it's it's very important to just have a strong relationship, even if it's, you know, there's a gap in age. For now, they're just enjoying the moment. I knew there was somebody out there. <laughs> and each other's company. He, he makes me, like, happy. That is the sweetest little match. Yeah. She actually has brothers, and so they're matched with friends. And so when we met them, they were all together. We're going to introduce you to them in the next couple weeks. It really is so cool and seems so rewarding for both parties to it is. do this kind of thing. Yeah, if you'd like to become a mentor or you just want to volunteer, we do have a link to sign up right now on our website. Just look under the Live a Little tab. Well, as we go to break, we check the road.